Hi everyone, it's Irene and I have a little project I'd like to share with you today. I've been asked how I've been making my little miniature envelopes and I just wanted to show you. Um, I was downstairs with my mom. I was not able to get to my computer. So on a little scratch pad, I had measured out a little envelope and it measures one inch wide, an inch and a half tall, and I just drew out the little envelope by putting, I found the middle of that one inch, half inch, and I drew from corner to corner, and then I clipped, I, I, I cut out the other piece to make the lip of the envelope. And I'll show you in a minute what that looks like. And I was able to make this project right here for my pocket letter, or really anything. It's my altered paper clips, and here, here's that envelope. So, if that makes sense, what I've done, you see that? That's how I made this. But you can also find this particular um, design all over the Google. Um, Pinterest, I'm sure, might have it. Um, I don't know how else to describe, but this is how I did mine. And then I just put it on my computer when I was able to come upstairs and did a little um, a scanning and mass produce them. And so... And I, what I did was I printed them out on polka dot paper, and the paper pad came from DCWV, and I also added these little hearts that I got from Valentine's Day. I, add, I adhered it with hot glue, and I backed it up with a blue button. And these are my blue ones, really pretty. And here are my red ones. And on the red ones, I used this little punch and I punched out the little heart, blue heart from the leftover blue paper from there. And I glossy accented the little heart there. I adhered it with hot glue and I put a red button. So it's pretty from the front and the back. But that is how I did that envelope. So for all the ones out there who want to know, it's one inch wide, an inch and a half tall. And that is how I did it. So I drew it out, and then I just fussy cut it, made it the size that I want. You can make them smaller, you can make them larger. I also received, um, let me just show you this real quick. I also re um, bought this, and I wanted to use this little snail right there for snail mail, and it's by Lawn Fawn, and this paper, uh, I mean this stamp is called Gleeful Gardens. LF799 is a part number, Gleeful Gardens really cute little snail. I've been dying for this little guy and I love the mushroom and there's a bigger snail and a smaller snail. It has a little envelope and you can probably take that stamp that out and enlarge it. That's a different way of making your envelope but I can't wait to put this little snail on my little white envelope for snail mail. So um, I've been having some questions about people wanting to know how I did it and that is how. So I hope this helps you guys. Um, if you have any questions leave them below. And uh, have a great day, everyone. Take care. Bye-bye.